Hello everyone, this is Genesis of Light Tree TV in English. Today, I'm going to unveil invisible secrets about the human body, the characteristics of Homo sapiens, written by Udeka. Homo sapiens is the latest humanoid model that integrates cutting-edge engineering technologies in the universe. Humanoid type mankind was created by putting together the scientific technologies that have been accumulated during the evolution of six major cycles in the universe. For 2.5 million years, the planet Earth has been an experimental planet for humanoid type mankind. Various versions of humanoid were created in the laboratory by cosmic biotechnologists. Various experiments have been done over time to adapt the created humanoid type mankind to the atmosphere of the planet Earth. Through this process, the humanoid types could be upgraded. The current Homo sapiens is the model optimized for the Earth's environment. Homo sapiens is the humanoid optimized for the planet Earth. It was created by the will of the Creator to end the sixth major cycle and start the seventh major cycle in the grand universe. It was prepared as a brand new coat for spirit soul to travel the material world in the seventh major cycle of the universe. The planet Earth is the only cosmic seed planet to open the seventh major cycle of the grand universe and is the hometown of Homo sapiens. To record the purpose of creating Homo sapiens and the characteristics of Homo sapiens, Udeka leaves this writing. Human beings can realize the highest consciousness, embody various emotions and desires, and achieve the highest level of creativity among all living creatures. This high consciousness can be realized because there are a variety of invisible sophisticated devices that can implement consciousness. Modern medicine and science explain this as the mysterious function of the brain. Someone who can see the invisible world can see that the sophisticated, complex, and intangible devices are installed in the human body and are more sophisticated than the devices of the most delicate clock in the world. By these intangible devices, human life phenomena are maintained. All life forms have the visible cells, tissues, and organs. Life is maintained by the cooperation of organic systems. All living creatures have invisible devices installed. The more sophisticated and complex the devices are, the higher consciousness can be achieved. There are various levels of consciousness in every living thing. Every species has its own kind of intangible devices that fit the species. The more highly evolved a life form is, the more sophisticated devices are installed. By the humans who are opening their eyes to the invisible world, it will soon be revealed that the writings of Udeka are the truth of the universe.
when Homo sapiens was created by the Creator, there was the purpose of the creation. Human being is the one who is capable of doing everything imaginable. Humans were created by the combination of the following four types of genetic traits that had been created earlier in the universe. Energy of fishes, energy of birds, energy of reptiles, and energy of mammals. The energies created during the evolutionary process of the grand universe had all been integrated, which created a whole new humanoid type. Humans have all these four types of genetic traits, and a new type of life circuit diagram has been finally set up, which can coordinate these four types of energies. Four types of energies have been integrated within one system, allowing for a variety of complex life phenomena to be unfolded. Experiments for adaptation have been done on the planet Earth for a long time to realize and enhance various emotions and high consciousness. Homo sapiens is the latest model among all types of creatures ever created. To achieve the highest consciousness, Homo sapiens is managed and coordinated by the sophisticated life circuit diagram that surpasses artificial intelligence. Human beings are delicately operated by the hardware of the human body and the software of life circuit diagram. The engineering technologies in the grand universe are implemented in the microcosmic human body. The life circuit diagram is carved on the heart wall of every animal that has a beating heart and is different for each species of animal even for its individual being of the same species. It is also set differently for each person. Like the circuits of sophisticated robots, human life circuit diagram is complex. Being installed with the most complex life circuit diagram, humans are so much unstable in terms of energy, and have desires, emotions, and also strong sexual desires. Since a human has emotions, desires, and intense sexual desires, and also has consciousness formed through running, he is managed and controlled so that only the information allowed to him is implemented within the scope of his life program through metahumanoid consciousness implementation system, which is linked to life circuit diagram. Every spirit soul has its own life program and different level of consciousness that can be implemented. The talents to be embodied for each spirit soul is predetermined and has a timeline for manifestation. As the talents has different levels of hierarchy for each spirit soul, humans are born unequal from birth. The realm of human consciousness, unconsciousness, subconsciousness, and pleasant consciousness is operating to make every human believe that he manages his own life by his free will. Although every happening looks to be accidental or done by his disposal, but in fact it is not. 
The belief that you live your life and your own discretion is a great illusion. In the human conception vessel, there are 12 emotion cores that are invisible to the human eye and can implement emotion. In the human governor vessel, there are seven consciousness cores that are invisible to the human eye and can implement consciousness. The life circuit diagram on the heart wall manages and controls all the diseases. It also directs all the meridian roots and acupoints in the human body. Life circuit diagram controls the meta-humanoid consciousness implementation system. Thus, it can control every bit of emotion, feeling, and even dream. Life circuit diagram is optimized for the life program of a spirit soul. It is finalized after approval by the Committee of Karma and the Committee of Reincarnation in the 11th dimension, reflecting the spirit soul's material experience in this life course. Life circuit diagram is adjusted every seven years for physical adjustment of the body, and every five years for fine-tuning of life program by one's higher self and the government of the heaven. Life circuit diagram is controlled by the thought adjuster that stores the spirit soul's program. The thought adjuster represents the uniqueness and individuality of each spirit soul. The authority to modify the information in life circuit diagram is primarily given to one's higher self and secondarily to the government of the heaven. Life circuit diagram is optimized for the contents of the life program. It is the higher self and the government of the heaven that control a thought, an emotion, and even the consciousness so that the life program works out well. Human being is the one who is capable of doing everything imaginable. Even the quality and spectrum of the contents which human can imagine are feasible only if the contents should exist in the program of life circuit diagram first. Anyone can hardly implement the same ideas as Einstein. No one can implement the same ideas as Lo Zha, the founder of Taoism. Only the one who has a role or a mission is scheduled to implement such unique and distinct consciousness. This is true nature of human. This is the unpainted face of the heaven. What has been already determined in the invisible world is just manifested in the visible world. This is the true meaning of the complete control by the heaven. The universal truth of saying, there is nothing wrong in this universe, has a similar context. The heaven is the parent of all living creatures. The heaven manages the material world safely, removing all variables through ripe circuit diagram of all living creatures. This is the way the heaven works. The Creator is directing the grand universe through the thought adjuster given to every spirit. 
This is called the wholeness consciousness of the grand universe. Things that are scheduled to happen will happen. Things that do not happen means that there are no programs or the programs are not working yet. It has nothing to do with my wishes and prayers. It has nothing to do with my beliefs and convictions. It has nothing to do with the way I judge right and wrong. The heaven just goes its own way that it has set by itself. After the collapse of material civilization, all the sciences, learnings, and religions in the world will suffer chaos. Alfred North Whitehead, a 20th century Western philosopher, expressed the sad fate of scientists as follows. Science has the sad fate of a Greek tragedy. The laws of the middle world will be revealed as the laws of the middle world. The time will come when the scientific common sense, religious doctrines, and hypotheses of learning collapse and are re-established. When that day comes, you will see a tragedy sadder than a Greek tragedy. A sad era of scientists, religious men, and intellectuals. April 21st, 2017, Udekar writes, translated by Genesis. Thank you. There is also an English blog run by the Tree of Life in the Light. So please refer to the address below here.